Welcome to BalsaCircle.com, your one-stop shop for all of your event decor. Today we're going to show you how to do this really cute DIY tutu high chair look for your one-year-old's first birthday. Of course, there's going to be a million pictures taken. We want to make it as cute as possible. So let's go ahead and dive into this look. Let's start with our satin ribbons. This is a 7 8 lavender satin ribbon. They come in different colors. We're actually going to be using a blush, lavender, ivory, purple, and fuchsia. We're starting with this ribbon that are going all the way around the outside of the tray for the actual high chair. So what we measured out ours to be is six foot seven inches. So make sure that you measure it and leave at least six inches to a foot on each side so you can tie it later. And now we're going to be measuring our tool. Each of the tool ribbons are going to be 32 inches and then we're going to double it and put it in half. So these are our glittered tool fabric rolls that we're using. We're using them in several different colors. Don't worry, everything's in the description below. Now, now, you're going to double it up like this or fold it in half. Take that top part, fold it over that main ribbon and pull those two tails through. Now we're gonna be doing this over and over and over again. So if you wanna see that again, you can always rewind just a touch and see how we do it. But every single ribbon, every single tool piece is gonna have that same kind of motion there. Let's go ahead and show you once again what we're doing here with this ribbon. This ribbon is the same thing, it's 32 inches. Now for the ribbons, a little tip they can be a little bit longer I think it's really fun to have not just this perfectly symmetrical thing here as you can see we're doing it once again just pulling it through and some of the ribbons are just a little bit longer than some of the tool it just gives that really DIY fun look and I think it adds to the whole character of it so just doing this over and over obviously with different color tool ribbon we have so many different kinds and this gives that really fun artistic look on the high chair. Now we're also incorporating our other satin ribbons that are seven, eight inches and pulling them through. As you can see, the theme that we chose are multiple shades of pink and purples. And we have a little bit of kind of ivory or a light baby yellow too, as well. Obviously you can pick whatever color that you want. As we flip it over, just wanted to show you how nice it looks on the other side. They kind of look like a man's tie when it's all kind of done and put together. Now here we're showing you small little little Velcro dots here. You can get these and place several of them around. Gosh, we did how many of these? I would say maybe eight or nine and they come in a pack. So you should definitely have enough. The reason why we did this, we wanted the tutu not to sag. So we wanted that really clean line. And if anybody pulls at it, it's, it's a much harder pull there. So at the end, like I mentioned in the very beginning of the video, you want to have that extra ribbon so you can tie it at the very back of the tray here as we did. So there you go. There is the first part of our look here. Now we're just going to move on to the little hat that we're putting on top. And then after that, we're going to move on to the lettering that we did with the silk flowers. So for this hat, basically you're just going to be nading some color paper, some tulle, which is going to be 16 inches for the hat and a small little tulle skirt ribbon that you're going to see shortly. We're taking that six inches by six, six inches and putting some glue at the very edge. Now you want to make sure that tip is very, very tight at the top. Now this is where you might want to bring in your chopsticks so you don't burn off your fingers like I've done multiple times. I think my fingers are like, you know what? We've given up go ahead, make it cute and we'll sacrifice ourselves. <laughs> but once you have that glue together, then you can cut it to any size. Our hat here is a little tall, but um, you can definitely just trim it to any size that you want. Once that hat is put together, then you're just going to put that tool, that really cute glittery tool. Here is kind of our purple look. You're going to smear that hot glue really, really nice and thin because it's going to seep through that tool just a touch. So you want to keep it nice and clean. Once that's done, you're just going to cut off the rest of the tool there. Make sure everything is nicely put together. Now, this is so much more special than actually having to buy these at the store or maybe have them custom made. These are so cute. You can do them in a various amount of colors. And now we're just taking some really light baby pink tool here, cutting it and folding it in half. So it's a little bit darker. And now all we're doing is we're taking some light pink ribbon and getting that same length. 
length. And both of these are 16 inches long. Just taking some lavender thread here. Now you want to probably take some light baby pink ribbon, but you know, we didn't really have any on us. So we just got something as close as possible, but you wanna get either white or light pink, something that you don't see. Take some thread there. All I'm doing is just making a little knot. And we're taking that ribbon and that tool and fastening it together with our, our sewing technique here and just doing a little bit of a ripple effect here. All we're doing is we're basically just pulling it through, doing little kind of waves and pulling that needle through, almost like an accordion type look here. So all you're doing is just like rolling them up and down and bringing that thread through each of the waves. I know I'm probably being so not, you know, technical when it comes to sewing. So excuse me if any professional sewer out there are seamstress but you know you you get it with DIY you just do what you can and, and make it super cute so once that entire thing is done then you're just going to bring the two sides together and finish up that thread there and put a little knot in it so you don't have to get super complicated with this you can definitely just do tool or you can you know use something else to make the bottom really cute but we just thought this just tied in the whole tutu skirt with the actual high chair look really really nicely once that tutu is done then you just put some glue at the very bottom of the hat and secure it as you can see we have obviously some extra of the tool on the outside and you just cut it to size whatever that you'd like maybe you want it a little bit longer but we want it nice and short so it makes it a really dainty look so once that's done super cute we just have one more thing to do this is basically just like a little fluffy circle that you put on top you know you can get a bag of these and they come in an assortment of colors now just taking some really cute small thin ribbon here staying in that color theme that you're doing and just placing it on the sides with some hot glue there just right in the middle or right underneath make sure you make it long enough obviously your baby can most likely will either choose to wear this or not but you can always just put it on the high chair and just do it for looks once that's done let's go ahead and move on with the letters that we're going to be putting in front of that tray or in front of the high chair obviously we're going to be spelling the number one now we cut these on the cricket however you can cut it out with the template and we're taking these really really cute flowers here and they're in the color of ivory now these are kind of like a medium flower when you're talking about like the smaller faux flowers and we thought these were perfect because they are very dainty they've got the pearls kind of popping out there and also they fit perfectly for this dainty look very very easy and just take some glue dots on the very top and bottom and you're just going to fasten it onto the actual tool skirt that we did so easy i love this look i can tell you right now your guests will think this is the cutest and also definitely social media worthy this is instagram verified here for any kind of shots that your little one will be so as you can see it turned out really beautifully you can see all the ribbons how they're at different lengths and also the tool and they vary in colors hopefully you guys enjoyed this if you did make sure that you like the video share it with a friend and subscribe for all of your creative decor and event ideas until next time stay creative